What was it like here, the fishery? I mean, that was a long time ago. I can't even imagine how many fish there were here and, and the lack of people. There was a lack of people. There, were, there, were, um, there was a lack of people. And the, the, big, the big difference, I don't know that there's a lot less fish today. If you t look at different species, if you look at tarpon, I don't know that there are a lot less fish uh, tarpon today. But when when um, these fish were migrating up the ocean side and some of these banks in the back, <clears throat> and there had not been a boat for a mile to disturb them, nothing had disturbed them. They were in a natural state for a mile. And there may have been 50, 100, 500 fish in a school coming up the ocean side. A string of school that just kept coming and coming and coming. But today, today they can't go 200 yards in a lot of places. They can't go 200 yards without being disrupted. So that's 500 fish get, get uh, dispersed and a third of them go out deep. They go out and go out <clears throat> where nobody's fishing. And nobody's going to see them, and a third of them turn around and go down in uh, by the bridge and sit on the bottom. And, a, <clears throat> and the next thing you know, you have five or seven fish coming in a school instead of five hundred. So that that's what happens. You, you, they've been dispersed quite a bit. But you know what? What I've noticed here, I've started doing this maybe about uh, thirty-five years ago. And I remember uh, Harry Spear saying, wow, it used to be so great. And 35 years ago, it was unbelievable. And, but with what you've done with the, with the school and teaching these people how to cast and how to fish and where to put the fly and, and the great uh, equipment that we have, we can still catch a bunch of fish, ironically, because you'd think that they're so smart and so beat up that they're difficult to catch. But I still think that if I had anywhere in the world to go fish for tarpon, and big bonefish, it'd be right here. It would be here. And yep. that's a remarkable statement to see this place last and endure what it has.